Welcome back. You're watching The Nation at 5 right here on CNN News 18. We're taking you right now to breaking news we've got coming out of Kerala where we're learning that the National Investigative Agency has arrested an absconding master trainer. Now, this may be a master weapons trainer. We'll bring you more details in just a second. He belongs to the band PFI, the Popular Front of India outfit. We're going to bring you more details, but all of these developments have taken place in Kanur. The accused is identified as Jafar Biman Davida, and we'll bring you more details about him. But he's been on the run in a PFI Kerala case that authorities have been investigating over the last few months. Now, he has been tracked down, as we say, said, in Kanur. Now, this is by the NI Fugitive Tracking Agency and the ATS. My colleague Neetu Rekha. Kumar has joined us to bring us more details on this. Let's just go over to her to understand more. Uh, Neetu, first if you could tell us why the NI was pursuing Jafar in the first place and just clarify for us what exactly his position was within the PFI. Uh, tell me what your understanding from the NIA is that uh, uh, on Monday they arrested an absconding trainer of the band. They, they called him a master trainer of the band uh, popular front of India from his house in Kannur district in Kerala itself. So the accused has been identified as Jafar uh, Bhiman Tavida and was on the run in a PFI case registered in 2022 relating to a conspiracy by the organization to establish an Islamic rule in India by 2047. What we understand is that he was eventually tracked down to his house in Kannur by the NIA fugitive tracking team and the ATS Kerala. And uh, that is how they have made the arrest. He's the 59th accused to be arrested in this case in which uh, NIA has so far charged cheated about 60 persons.